If you found this video, it means you have an LG TV and you're experiencing the same issue that I was with the HDMI no signal error. If you query the internets, you will find this is very common. So as the TVs get older, the HDMI chip quits working and then you basically can't use your TV anymore. I have a solution for this. I think the big, biggest solution probably is quit buying LG TVs. But So according to the internet, the problem is the solder joints on the HDMI chip itself get minuscule cracks in them. And so what they have you do is hold a hairdryer on there for a while and that sort of uh, melts the solder and then and makes it work for a while. And they say it could work for a couple of weeks, could work for a year. I tried it and it, the TV worked for a couple of years and then it quit again. So I decided, why don't I try and get around the problem? So if it's the HDMI chip, maybe I'll go with one of the other chips in the TV, right? So the, the component chip might be the way to go. So I went on Amazon and I looked up an HDMI converter to like 1080 uh, component inputs. And that's what I ended up getting. I'll put a link in the video and that actually allowed it to work. So if I switch it back over, let's see here, to the component two, then you can see now it's working just fine and the signal is strong, uh, the, the video looks great. So here's the converter I got, it's a, HDMI to YPBPR 1080p scaler. So you plug in the whatever your HDMI input device is on this side. In my case, it's a Roku. And then on this side, you have the component signals going into the back of the TV. Yep. Thanks for watching my video. And if you liked it, hit the like button and think about subscribing. Thanks again.